Uh, acne scarring, broad-based depressed acne scars tend to respond the best. Um, ice pick scars respond poorly, and in general, chicken pox scars do not respond well either. Uh, I want to mention this um, because I think that especially in olive complected or patients of, with darker skin types that are not candidates for laser resurfacing procedures, I don't think there's anything better than liquid injectable silicone. And these are great broad-based depressed scars. Um, they're, they, they, they were an area of concern for the patient. They caused them to feel very self-conscious. And after a single treatment, you can see that the temple area is significantly flatter on both sides. And then again, this is one of my uh, younger Hispanic patients with lots of broad-based depressed acne scars in the right cheek. And this is following two treatments to the right cheek and two treatments to the left cheek. You can see a smoother appearance, and he still has active acne. So my patients that get this done, I encourage them to continue in the care with their dermatologist to keep the uh, acne under control. Mm -hmm.